Every time the Doctor regenerates, Doctor Who also changes, becoming a new version of itself. The return of Russell T. Davies, the TV icon who revived Doctor Who in 2005, brings a special sense of familiarity with the end of Jodie Whittaker and Chris Chibnall's period. The Hobian's excitement for a new season has never been higher, but what can we realistically anticipate from the program going forward? Join us as we anticipate what will occur in Doctor Who Season 14 by hopping into the nearest phone booth. Doctor Who Season 14 Potential Release Date When will it air? The BBC has stated exactly when we may anticipate new episodes, featuring our very first glimpse at NQD Gatwa in action as the future Doctor, following Jodie Whittaker's farewell appearance as the 13th Doctor and that much anticipated and incredibly surprising regeneration. Unfortunately, fans will have to wait a very long time. Mark November 2023 on your calendars for the release of the 60th anniversary specials, which will star David Tennant and Catherine Tate two celebrities who are beloved by viewers. Following will be Gatwa's first complete episode as the Doctor in 2023, throughout the holiday season. Doctor Who Season 14 cast, who's in the new season. As is customary with a handover, the return of Russell T. Davies as showrunner heralds the appearance of a new Doctor. Fans were surprised to find on May 8, 2022, that sex education actor and cutie Gatwa has already been announced as our new Doctor. They had anticipated the announcement to occur in Jodie Whittaker's final adventure. Gatwa reacted to this time in history by saying, There aren't nearly the words to convey how I'm feeling. A mixture of being incredibly honored, incredibly excited, and of course, a tiny bit afraid. Every single one of my very gifted predecessors has handled that one-of-a-kind responsibility and privilege with the utmost care because this position and this program mean so much to so many people around the world, including myself. I'll make every effort to follow suit. Working with Russell T. Davies is a dream come true because he is almost as well known as the Doctor. His prose is vivid, thrilling, extremely intellectual, and bursting with peril. A metaphorical stage for actors. The entire team has been incredibly friendly and supportive of the show. In spite of how intimidating it seems, I know I'm joining a family that is incredibly supportive. I may only have one heart, unlike the Doctor, but I am giving it my all for this show. The rest of the new Season 14 cast has not yet been formally revealed, although some of the popular favorites for the Doctor himself may wind up making an appearance in a different role. That includes Joe Martin, a character we've already seen and who could easily assume the role of the fugitive Doctor. Recently, Digital Spy compiled some of our own suggestions for the Doctor, including Phoebe Waller-Bridge from Fleabag as well as Michaela Seal and Michael Sheen who's to say they won't appear on the program in another capacity later on. Ollie Alexander is one name that keeps coming up repeatedly. In addition to being closely associated with Davies as a result of its a sin, Ollie also had a role in a Doctor Who spin-off during his time on that program. Making him a new companion or maybe giving him a snarky guest role wouldn't be too difficult. Nandip Gill made a suggestion that Yaz might make a comeback to the show someday just before Ancuti made her declaration. When asked on BBC's The One Show if the centenary special would be Yaz's final performance, the actress responded, I will own it. Well, not forever, because in the Doctor Who universe, everything is possible. However, does unquestionably come to an end in that episode, albeit not permanently since. I made it, did you see? Actress commented. Doctor Who season 14 plot, what will happen? Piers Wenger, the director of drama for the BBC, stated, as with every change of Doctor and showrunner, will be radical changes ahead, even before Russell's return was made public. Few could have imagined that this move would involve the showrunner of Doctor Who who was most beloved returning to the program years after he initially left. Russell commented on this by saying, Being back on my favorite program makes me incredibly happy. We're time traveling too quickly, though, and I still have a whole season of Chris Chibnall's fantastic Doctor Who, played by Jodie Whittaker, to look forward to. For now, I'll continue to watch. Chibnall said about his successor as follows, The return of one of Britain's screenwriting gems for Doctor Who's 60th anniversary is really thrilling and appropriate. The baton that is about to be returned to Russell was built by him. There are numerous reasons for Doctor Who, the BBC, the Welsh film and television industry, and, let's face it, everyone else in the entire globe, to be extremely excited about what lies ahead. Fans did get concerned, though, when it was revealed that Bad Wolf will replace BBC Studios as the producer of Doctor Who, potentially costing the BBC £40 million for every 10 episodes produced. The BBC has recently disputed this and clarified that they would still retain commercial oversight. It is important to note that the Times report said that Bad Wolf would also take control of artistic direction. We are tremendously enthusiastic about Doctor Who's future. The show will ultimately be produced and distributed by BBC Studios, and this production collaboration aims to make long-term investments that will significantly expand upon the franchises and shows already enormous global popularity, said a BBC representative. We can only hope that Russell will still be able to add his own style to the program, possibly even providing us with more uplifting LGBTQ content than Doctor Who has ever included.
Yaz and the Doctor may have had a queer romance in the Flux finale, but hinting isn't really enough. Furthermore, Jodie Whittaker's final episode didn't do much to further this. It's past time for Doctor Who to embrace the present by featuring a homosexual doctor. And in light of all of that, we wouldn't be shocked if Russell used this chance to make Ancuti's Doctor a lesbian. Doctor Who Season 14 trailer, when can we see it? A thrilling trailer has now offered fans a preview of what will be released next year. Naturally, it gave viewers their first glimpse of Ancuti Gatwa in action, with a brief clip of the new Doctor fervently yelling, Will someone explain me what the heck is going on here? Russell T. Davies has also declared that Ancuti will serve as the 15th Doctor, following the regeneration that saw David Tennant return to the position. If you thought David Tennant's presence was unexpected, we've got lots more shocks in store, he declared. There is mystery, horror, robots, puppets, danger, and fun on the way to Ancuti's 15th Doctor. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more.